Hey guys, this is Perry Guy 88 and welcome to Let's Play Earthbound. This is episode 83. This game is brought to you by GameVideo.com. Yeah. Last episode, we were exploring the world of Magican, and now and we're the dark side of it. So now uh, we're gonna keep going. Oh man, no, not these guys again. It's the loaded dice again. Ah oh, man, me and Ness do not like these guys. These wusses like to call for help. And the most annoyed help too. Whoa, what the? They call it uncontrollable orb? Well, I mean sphere? Well, I didn't see that in a while. Like, to remind you, they uh, have fire attacks and they explode when you destroy them. Also, the guy behind me, you can barely see him, but that's the Electro Swoosh. It has a full watch any chance of dropping a sudden gut spill, and it's one of the most polite enemies possible. They like to greet you one turn, and then the turn after next, they'll use an electric attack like that. Oh no! And also, the, the most stupid thing, of course, is that Ness neglected to get the Franklin badge from Paula before we got teleported, so now we're gonna actually get hit. But if you were smart enough to actually bring the Franklin badge with you, these guys would absolutely be no threat. But now, uh, we gotta actually have to be concerned about these guys. So, yeah, good going there, Ness. Alright. But, well, that's okay. Ness is perfect. He, he can handle this, even though he's by himself. Oh man, I, I miss- I, I, I hardly can remember the days when uh, Ness would have to be alone and fight enemies. Uh, but now- but these guys are really a big pain and we- and Ness is having trouble running away. Like we said before, it's not good for Ness to gain levels around here. Oh boy, it exploded, of course. Oh man. Okay. Well, we- we made it through that. Okay, let's hope we don't meet any more enemies because it would get annoying to do so. Whoa, this really is a clone. Oh, wow, by the way, he's not talking. You can't hear him, but, yeah. He he's typical silentness. And he gave us a baseball cap. Wow, that's worthless. We had I remember how when we got this. This is like the first couple episodes. Oh, well, well, who cares, right? Oh, great, we got the bag of Dragonite. I think Ness has three now. That's very useful. Girl. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, there's another present up here that you might want to get. All right. It hits in the... Yeah, it's the goddess band. Okay, yes. Let's go ahead and put this on right now. It definitely increases his defense. Okay, yes, uh, we gotta throw away a few things now. Because this is, uh, inventory is extremely full. Okay, there we go. Let's keep going then. Yeah! Oh no no not another one! Oh man! Uh, great. Okay, you, 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 yeah, we haven't really encountered that, but that's the beautiful UFO. I think you beat them at Scaraba. Yeah, yeah, you beat this one at Scaraba. She's just like she likes to heal a lot of people, and uh, she drops a variety of items. I don't remember which one. It doesn't really matter too much because they're pathetic anyway. Well, at this point in the game, they're not very useful, so yeah, you, you don't, it doesn't matter. Okay, then, uh, whoa, okay. Ah, uh, man. Okay, right, I'm real, I'm, I'm serious, I'm really at getting tired of these guys. You can't run away, uh, and you can hardly, and Ness is having a hard time hitting them, too. Okay, well, alright. Okay, that wasn't very good, Ness, I was hoping you'd do better than that, considering that you're at level 89. Come on, Ness! No! Oh, man, I'm really starting to get... I'm really starting to get annoyed. Extremely, here. Okay, well, alright. That doesn't make me feel any better. Let's just get out of here as fast as possible. Oh, great. It's an electric... Electro swoops. Let's see if he can run away here. Okay, of course, that's his typ typical nest that he has trouble running away. I don't know why he can't run away, though. Is it because he's, he's not very fast? I don't understand. Oh, and he got hit by an electrical attack. Oh, man, that hurts. Come on, Ness. Seriously, get out of here now. Oh, man, how come you... How come you're perfect at everything else, but you suck at running away? Oh, oh okay, okay, that worked. Alright, then. Oh no, no, well, let's see if we can beat 
We use our special skills to avoid this loaded dice and roll the Magic Hat Bat. Yes, yeah, a brand new weapon. Let's go ahead and definitely equip that. Yep, that helps a lot. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on. Whoa. Oh no. Okay, we can't avoid this. What the? Oh, what? Oh, okay, yeah, that that's the French kiss of death. It has a full watch of chance of dropping a PSI caramel, and just like the French kiss of, I'm like the normal kiss of death. Her, this thing's kiss, like, uh, is poisonous. Again, I really don't know. This lips, the little slowly lips are really creepy. And combining with the eyes, they almost make like a completely demonic face. Could you imagine the electro swooshes eyes being above the lips' head, the top of the lips? Oh, good. okay, never mind. I'm, I'm really apologize for putting that image in your brain, folks. Oh, no. Oh, man, we get to see that combination again. Okay, never I guess there's nothing we can do to avoid this one. This, this, uh, uh oh, man, I can barely see it. Oh, okay, I'm actually much more concerned about the fact that this can't run away still. Because this is so messed up. Ugh. Why do you, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm sorry if I'm complaining about this too much, and I've not as pumped this before, but really, this area around here is its very, very annoying. It has tons of enemies that you, you can't run away from when you, you want to. Okay, that's the magic tart. That, that's very useful. We should prob we'll probably uh, heal up here. Yeah, heal the poison, obviously. And Ness is going to uh, eat a brain food lunch. To recover his health and PP. Okay, yeah, there. Now, now Ness is a. Uh... Oh, you gotta use the magic tart now. Okay, let's see if that's a wise idea. It probably isn't, but that doesn't matter. Whoa, whoa. Okay, we avoided that thing. The question marks are not that difficult to avoid, unless, unless it's like in a completely narrow road like this. Okay, there's the carefree ball. We gotta already explain what he does, but the. Okay, we can't run away, of course. But the guys behind the uh, the, the carefree bobs is the Mr. Molecule. Okay, there we go, Mr. Molecule. He has a two 128 just to drop the magic tart, and uh, they're extremely weak. They're like the attack slugs around here. They have PS strong PSI attacks, but can't use them for the next few turns. But they, but when they, uh, a few turns later, they will be able to use it, and it will not be very pleasant. And I, Ness and I extremely despise the Carefree Bob, because they're not only are they strong, but they keep throwing bombs out of nowhere. And they occasionally throw in a Super Bob, which hurts around 200 to 300 HP. Okay, yeah, Ness is gonna die here, but not, no, 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 not really. Because he's gonna heal himself up here. Come on, Ness, you, oh man, Ness is in a pickle here, he can't eat. Try as he might, he can't run away from this battle. Oh no, and the molecules are able to concentrate. We don't got any choice in this. We're gonna have to use one of the bags of Dragonite to defeat them quickly. So here we go. Alright, yeah, yeah, this once again turned into shit boss from Dragon Ball Z. Seriously, man. He, he looks awesome, though. I can't believe none of you can see this. Okay, well, at least we can be able to uh, get through this level here. Ah, I hate the carefree bobs. I know, I said this already. Oh, uh, it's another one of these. This reminds me of the gold mine episode where they got tons of extremely annoying enemies that won't leave you alone and you can't run away from. Yeah, it's just like that. Okay, we're gonna see if we can manage it. Yeah, there we go. Whoa, whoa, okay. Alright, we're gonna press our luck and try to. Oh, what the? Oh, they came back! Ugh. Oh, oh man, and, and they came back too. This is, this is just not good. We just completely messed that up. Uh, I guess we'll got a choice, Ness. Whoa, okay, yeah. Good skills there, Ness. You dodged that. Oh, okay, but we can't dodge that. And we got back to attack. That's lovely, and it's the exact same group of enemies we just faced a few minutes ago. That's even better. <laughs> All right. Yeah. This is just... Not wonderful. What am I talking about? It's the worst. What? You ran away from... <laughs> You you spend like about like two or three minutes trying to get away from the that, that group of enemies, but at that time you ran away instantly. Uh how many how long is this episode? I want this to end. Oh, I hate this episode so much. Yes, I admit, yes, I actually hate one of the Earthbound episodes here. 
Oh god, come on. But don't worry, okay, I'm sure there's gonna be better ones after this, but right now, this one sucks so bad. Okay, yeah, this is extremely close to dying. I'm actually surprised he's still alive right now. Okay. Whoa, okay, that's good. Let's uh, Now let's see if you can run away here. Come on, Ness, come on. Oh! Uh, <laughs> oh, man. Come on, run away, please. Oh, thank God. Come on, run. We gotta get to that squiggly thing. Come on, come on, run. No, no, whoa, whoa. Yes! 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 Oh, we finally did it. Oh, God. Okay, let's end the episode here, guys. Okay, that's the end of episode 83. Stay tuned for episode 84 when we go through the Sea of Eden here. That's what this place is, I'm, I'm guessing here. And uh, face Ness's most evil, evilest thing inside his body ever. You'll, you'll see what I mean uh, when it happens. All right, this is Barricade 8. I'll see you guys later.